I V M. Basuda, as you know, was born in Ajmer, grew up in Mathura, studied in Agra, oh. then came to Bombay mm-hmm. for work. Mm-hmm. For somebody who was not a Bombay wala, Gateway was the sign that you have made it right. in Bombay. In the first release, there was no mention of B R Chopra as a producer. Oh. The logo of B R Films was not there mm-hmm. in the first mm-hmm. time it was released. अभी B R Chopra ने जब फिल्म देखी, उन्हें पता चला ये तो रिलीज कर गया मेरे पैसे से. उसके बाद B R Chopra ने टेलीग्राम लिखा. पहले टेलीग्राम लिखा जाता था और जीता. तो बादे में. Wow. Again, he is younger than और जीता. Wow. <laughs> Asrani, I think, was also very much trained. actor he right. has a training in acting he's yeah. a F- fii trained FBI, yeah. uh, at that time it was fii because oh, really? television to us zamane mein tha nahi tha nahi so it was called the film institute this is why we call film historians on our oh, episode guys so damn. they can fact yeah. check us basuda ke film mein he never wanted songs he used songs in the background na jaane kyun agar aap dekhe it yeah. it plays in the background hmm. uh, rajni gandha mein bhi the song plays in the background jab wo hmm. log uh, cab mein hote hain hmm. so uh, the the producer wanted the the storyline yeah. demanded commerce ek, versus haan, art commerce a battle as old yeah. as cinema par par movie bechenge kaise yana yeah. to hona yeah. chahiye yeah. kuch yeah. to hona chahiye and then he added in the end he added the cast of the film to be replaced uh, with uh, dharmendra and hema mali in the song okay. to amol palekar aap dekhte hain beech gaane mein amol palekar aa jata hai screen pe yeah, and yeah. Yeah, romances yeah, yeah. with uh, vidya yeah. sinha yes. जब भी वो ऑफिस जाती है जैक्सन तो लाराम के yeah, yeah, yeah. मैनेजर से मिलने hmm. तो बेचारे की बहुत हालत खराब होती है हाँ yeah. सोचा था फटना uh-huh. नहीं बोलना इधर इसलिए मैंने बोला हिस्टोरियन के मुंह से ऐसे शब्द अच्छे नहीं लगते हैं तो शोभा नहीं देते शोभा नहीं देते तशरीफ फट गई थी तशरीफ में थोड़ी सी अनकंफर्टेबल चीजें हो रही थी तशरीफ में थोड़ी सी दरार आने की आशंका दिख रही थी आशंका हाँ देखो बेटा <laughs> जिंदगी में दो तरह के लोग होते हैं जो जीतते हैं और वो जो हारते हैं जो ऊपर होते हैं और जो नीचे होते हैं जो नीचे नहीं होते हैं वो ऊपर होते हैं जिंदगी के क्रिकेट मैच में ड्रॉ नहीं होता या तो आप जीतते हैं या हारते हैं और जीतता वही है जो ऊपर होता है और ऊपर वही होता है जो हैजेज वेल सुनता है हेलो एंड वेलकम टू हैजेज तो फिर मैं विद्या जी को कैसे पटाऊ देखो बेटा तुम्हें एल्फा मेल बनना पड़ेगा अरे यू डूइंग अमोल पालेकर देखिए सर मैं ओके वी विल वर्क ऑन मेरा इससे कोई लेना देना नहीं मुझे बुलाया गया है दैट लाइन दैट कोट वाज़ फ्रॉम द 1976 फिल्म छोटी सी बात स्टारिंग अमोल पालेकर विद्या सिन्हा अशोक कुमार असरानी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंटली एंड होस्ट ऑफ अदर एक्टर्स हु विल कम टू टू डिस्कस छोटी सी बात विथ मी इन द स्टूडियो इज एज यूजल मैं होस्ट उर्जिता वानी हेलो कैसे This is the most sober and tender I have seen yeah. Urjita ever <laughs> for an episode. अरे ऐसी बात मत कीजिए हम भी sober बन सकते हैं ना वरना दोस्तों के साथ तो little little हमने भी लगाई है. And to discuss छोटी सी बात the expert on our panel today is uh, someone who calls himself a cinema historian in the making. I have taken a heritage walk that he conducted and I think he's has a lot of knowledge about a lot of things. But today we will talk about छोटी सी बात in particular. Uh, so please welcome to has today's well the historian in making mr ishan sharma namaskar 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 ishan mere ki dekha bhi namaskar bol ke nahi bhai kab kya hai duniya mein aise chand hi kuch log hote hain jinke aane ke baad pura vatavaran hindi ho jata hai kya baat ye matlab maine pehli baar aisa dekha hai ki within 15 minutes of talking to someone everything has converted into hindi and it's not like we are doing this out of obligation it's just that like you have done That's something your aura. Yeah, yeah that is your aura. की बातें बट कपल ऑफ फर्स्ट ईशान यूर द फर्स्ट प्रॉपर हिस्टोरियन वीव हैड ऑन आर शो दिस इज द फर्स्ट अमोल पालेकर फिल्म दैट वी आर डिस्कसिंग द फर्स्ट बासू चैटर्जी फिल्म वी आर डिस्कसिंग जो हेरिटेज वॉक का मैंने जिक्र किया दैट इज अ बासू चैटर्जी हेरिटेज वॉक दैट यू डू अराउंड बॉम्बे साउथ बॉम्बे टू बी पर्टिकुलर एंड Uh, I'll just let you little bit about how this came to be. That you walked up to me at the Mumbai Film Festival. You told us that you're a fa- you told me you're a fan of this yeah, show, or yeah. at least a listener yeah. fan. I don't know, uh, and you like the show. And I thought, what better way, b- better guest than a film historian for the episode? So Basu Chatterjee walk, uh, fan of the film, and you bought us really nice, sweet. postcards uh from choti si baat yeah. so thank you first of all for that 
uh ishan how did you find hazard age well and how does it feel <laughs> to be on the show you know it would age well <laughs> your your appearance yeah yeah yes. it it would age well i think but because you know you have hosted some good score, some good episodes on some of my favorite films okay like lutera oh you know lutera nice. is a i think it's one of the best historical fiction made by any indian filmmaker right. in the recent past right. so yeah it's 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 amazing to be on a show that you listen <laughs> So thank you, thank you, thank you. Nice. Uh, and uh, Urjit, <laughs> Vichari. Actually, this is so uh, weird because uh, you're the youngest person on this panel right now. Probably the youngest. For the first time, I think. Yeah, for, probably the youngest yeah. guest we've had. So the Urjit has even Jawan ko yaya. Jawan ko yaya. Ha. But yeah. this is so. Uh, it's the exact opposite because when it's someone younger, I'm like, man, how will I vibe with them? Like. Uh, their their <laughs> references are way newer than mine but for the first time you're younger than both of us but matlab ye aap samajh rahe ho abbas ka bhi yo nikal raha hai jo ki aise usually nahi nikalta kyunki the you know the millennial the boomer he is <laughs> ye mujhe pehli baar abbas se suddenly lag raha hai ki are abbas suddenly aap aise vibes kyu bolega abhi abhi suddenly ye abhi pata nahi main main khud gen z word hi bhul gaya main khud gen z words mere dimag mein aa hi nahi rahe ki iski beizzati bhi nahi kar sakti main abhi <laughs> but ishan But, uh, uh, let me in on a term before we started recording zillennial yeah yeah you know, zillennial hmm. cuz you just made the cut off between uh, 2000 born gen yeah. z and millennial yeah. nice so uh, take tell, take us to the start ishan uh, we'll also come to uh, urjita for you because uh, i'm assuming you haven't seen a lot of cinema around this time hmm. but how did you get into basu chatterjee how special is choti si baat do you remember the first time you heard about choti si baat or saw it so actually i wo i got into cinema main hindi mein bolta hu mujhe mazaa aati hai hindi mein mera sense of humor bhi udhar hi aata hai taaki listeners ko bhi maza aaye to sabse pehle mere dada ji ne mujhe ye film ka keeda diya i used to watch kl sahgal okay when i was 8 so oh my god <laughs> at the age of 8 i was watching a film that was released in 1940s right. early 40s Aap late 30s aap pokemon bhi urdu mein dekh rahe the kya mujhe abhi dekhiye udru to mujhe aati nahi par hindi theek thaak bol leta hu to but when at 8 you were watching kl sahel yeah. did you feel like it is something out of time with your other kids or was it very normal for you it was very normal because i didn't hang out much with the okay. people of my age <laughs> right. i had guessed that already i'm i knew ki you were the kind of guy jisko aisa hai ki bhai seniors ke sath hang out karne mein maza aata hai thoda gyan bhi milta hai apne umar ke bacche kya chup chap kar rahe hain kya hai kya hai usme okay to udhar se shuruaat hui but then i got into this whole uh, new wave parallel right. cinema thing hmm. badi gadab what age was hai. this This was about 11. Wow, okay. <laughs> कुछ कुछ ही समय बाद की बात है ये पैरल लाइन्स का जब तक स्कूल में सब्जेक्ट नहीं आया सब्जेक्ट टॉपिक नहीं आया था तभी आप पैरल सिनेमा देख रहे थे वेरी नाइस वेरी नाइस तो आई वॉज इंट्रोड्यूस टू अ फिल्म कॉल मंथन बाई श्याम बेनेगल विच केम आउट इन नाइनटीन सेवेंटी सिक्स और समथिंग Uh, which was about the making of Amul. Correct. Yes. And it is, I think, one of the best documentary, White Revolution. Uh, uh, a documentary film which okay. was, I think, made it like a feature film. Right. So, उधर से शुरुआत हुई थी. उसके बाद मुझे पता चला कोई एक फिल्म है गोलमाल जिसमें हमने ये अजय देवगन वाली गोलमाल देखी थी अच्छा वो देख चुके थे हाँ वो थोड़ा हम अपने जमाने की भी देख लिया करते थे फिल्म Did you like that गोलमाल रोहित शेट्टी वाली देखे असल में जो असल थी असल में जो असल थी आप समझ रहे हैं शब्द का खेल नहीं वो जब देखिए बोला द मोमेंट यू स्टार्टेड अवर आंसर विल देखिए आई न्यू दिस इज नॉट गोइंग टू बी अ पॉजिटिव आंसर नो इट वाज अ वेरी गुड फिल्म आई आई लव रोहित शेट्टी काइंड ऑफ सिनेमा क्योंकि कुछ गलतियां तो हम भी करेंगे ना अपने जमाने में बाद में जाके जिस पे पछतावा हो तो सॉरी रोहित बट व्हाट टू से सो आई आई रियली लाइक एक्चुअली फॉर अ 10 ईयर ओल्ड द अजय देवगन गोलमाल इज लाइक ideal right yeah like, it was yeah, ideal yeah yeah because i remember that time i was like around 10 12 right. and it was a rage yeah yeah, yeah, yeah it during was during our time yeah, yeah. i even watch uh, hera feri and all these of course yeah these are gold films right. these, these are the films that would age well yeah. someday <laughs> and they they have aged well i think they have they have i mean hera feri itself is now 23 years old yeah so, yeah. so about Your my age, age. Yeah, yeah, yeah. about my age yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so so these were the films that So, so side by side you were also watching your normal cinema normal cinema oh. thoda sa insano ki tarike <laughs> baki from golmal i watched the first basuda film that i watched was i think chameli ki shaadi 
Right. Oh, nice. So when you saw Rishikesh Mukherjee's Golmaal yeah. after watching Rohit Shetty's Golmaal, yeah. did you feel like oh this this is the kind of cinema that belong that I belong to or anything like that? No, I think I was too young to to understand. Yeah. 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 I was just watching cinema. Kesegal ki movie dekhte bhi nahi ye yaad nahi hai ki too young to watch these films. Kyunki us time mere dada ji ko mujhe dikhana tha. I was the side by product right. of that whole metamorphosis that Kare. was happening at that moment yeah, so yeah. chameli ki shaadi aur ye sab dekhne ke baad aur i think not many people know that chameli ki shaadi was vasuda right and from there i got to know about this film called choti si baat okay yeah. and but i didn't watch it until i was 20 something oh okay so a few years back yeah actually and then i saw it and then i wanted to be in mumbai mm. i wanted to visit bombay <laughs> So yeah that's the story of how I got into Vasudha and then I started reading about him In fact it's actually this one particular shot that yeah. you brought uh, this one where they're sitting against the backdrop having of chai. gateway of it having chai where you were wondering where have they shot this yeah. I want to go here which brought you to Bombay Yeah, yeah. it's a, it's a very expensive affair <laughs> <laughs> So which hotel was this This so it's an interesting fact yeah. would you like to tell us now should we say, yeah. actually just tell us Yeah there there so, is no hotel Yeah there there is no hotel now Achha, So okay. there are various theories the theory I th- I believed in was that it is the the yacht yacht club the royal yacht club mm-hmm. which is in front of the gateway mm. but agar aap uske upar jaye abhi it's closed i think for renovation or something mm. if you go upstairs you won't find the same angle Correct. in which it is yeah. shot okay. yeah. So there are two theories now the first is that Vasudha made a set and then oh. shot it on top of that mm. The second is I've got a picture on my WhatsApp some days ago of a, a Apollo Bandar refreshment center. It was a canteen like thing oh. which had these uh, wooden railings and windows hmm. the perch. So yeah. I thought that might be It the possible be yeah. place. So Because I'm not very sure. I'm still not convinced that that was the place. Because अगर ये set करना भी होता है तो फिर मतलब I'm thinking कि what is it about this backdrop that he wanted this particular backdrop जिसकी वजह से he yeah. made this whole set. No, this has an interesting story. Oh. आप अगर बंबई में आप तो शायद बंबई के हैं लोग बात मैं बंबई वाला नहीं हूँ तो जो बंबई वाले नहीं होते वो ये बात समझ पाएंगे क्योंकि बासुदा as you know was born in Ajmer, grew up in Mathura, studied in Agra. then came to bombay mm-hmm. for work mm-hmm. for somebody who was not a bombay wala gateway was the sign that you have made it right. in bombay yeah. nice yeah. finally in the film if you see choti si baat now like we are going into the sure, film sure, yeah. if you see the film this is the only time the first time that they really meet in in dream Correct. yeah yeah mm-hmm. he has made it right so oh, the gateway oh man that's so nice sweet. Yeah. uh before we come to urjit i just quickly uh do the synopsis of choti si baat uh, uh, so this is the imdb synopsis <laughs> a timid suitor seeks the help of a ruthless colonel to win the woman of his dreams when a bold young man begins to pursue her in this romantic comedy wow. uh, so yeah very very plain this is this was kind of like hitch before hitch <laughs> partner before partner yeah, but yeah. urjita you saw the film for the first time i'm assuming yes. tell us your thoughts man so first of all uh, i know like your anybody's first thought while watching the film would be that uh, acha this is partner before partner <laughs> hitch yeah, before hitch yeah. but i was like this is where i think ajab prem ki gajab kahani also takes inspiration okay because at least in ajab prem ki gajab kahani the guy he is also very simple seedha sada but it's just that not in amol palekar's way of seedha sada correct yeah like is मूवी में भी जो रणबीर कपूर जो है वो भी अपने दोस्तों से टिप ले रहा है ही डज नॉट हैव अ कर्नल विच आई फील अगर कर्नल होता इस फिल्म में देन इट वुड हैव बीन लाइक अ exact copy right, of correct. the same film but yeah. then like i like this whole structure that you know it just gives you so much insight into a boy's mind that when he falls in love with a girl he's not very direct he's not like ki main jaunga usse puchunga he's like you know what what if i fail correct because that whole realizer th- that whole uh, concept right ki if what if i fail like that in itself tells you how much he genuinely wants the girl mm-hmm. because wo fear hai ki agar nahi mili to uska aisa nahi ye nahi to aage mm. you know like ladki bus aur train teenon ke piche nahi bhagte ek gayi dusri aayi you know you know it is way way different from this kind of uh, ideology and this whole i i'm a big fan of this thought process ki agar main agar ye nahi mili to and the things he does just yeah. to ensure ki you know ye iske haath se na jaye uh, i like this story line anyway mm. kisi bhi movie mein dal do main dekh lungi hai but uh, yeah man i really to talk about why i really like the film uh, i think it's very sweet it's very simple and more importantly like 
everything the, the characters in the film right uh, first 15 minutes mein you see that she is making the first move yeah. i i was bored or i was like <laughs> you sure this was made in the 70s yo i don't think so i i genuinely liked it but uh, yeah more but aur bhi zyada points se wo baat mein baat we'll talk about that yeah. so ishan i wanted to uh, also get to this so uh, when we did your walk um, so again <coughs> when we talk about basu chatterjee rishikesh mukherjee they were known for this what was called middle of the road cinema yeah. mm-hmm. which was not entirely mainstream not entirely art film it was somewhere in between yeah. and mm-hmm. also the characters in the film like in choti si baat they are traveling by bus train yeah. यू नो एक स्कूटर लेना बाइक लेना एक बड़ी चीज़ है राइट सिंपल पीपल फ्रॉम सिंपल हम्बल बैकग्राउंड वर्किंग क्लास पीपल आई हैव ऑलवेज वॉन्डर्ड एंड नन ऑफ अस वर अलाइव एट दैट टाइम सो आई एम आई एम डिपेंडिंग ऑन यू टू गिव मी अ मोर ऑनेस्ट वर्जन ऑफ दिस दैट वेन दीज फिल्म वर प्लेइंग लाइक वी डिस्कस दी वार अ कपल ऑफ एपिसोड विच केम आउट इन सेवेंटी फाइव super duper hit i can imagine what the atmosphere must have been in a theater when a film like this is like dialogue bazi ho rahi hai wo yeah. even today if diwar plays it has similar reaction mm-hmm. were these films the rishikesh mukherjee basu chatterjee films and stars do cameos in this also mm-hmm. were they also running to like full houses did they also get a similar reaction or was it like different like what what was the what is the what is the history say on this Uh, so Vasuda was became a household name at okay. one point because Chitchor was a big hit. Right. Chitchor also starred uh, Amol Palekar. Amol Palekar. Yeah. It mm. made him a big star. Right. This was his first super hit. Mm. Mm. Zarina Wahab became a super mm. star for some time at least. Right. Did he play a similar role in this film? Yeah, simple, simple guy, normal okay. boy, boy next door kind yeah, of yeah, yeah, yeah. image. I think till about the late 80s, Amol Palekar played similar yeah. roles. Yeah. so he i think he uh, basuda and his characters provided a relief at the time of the angry young man yeah ek taraf jahan pe inspector vijay maar raha hai logo ko robin hood wagaira he is not bothered with politics at all in fact he watches those people and he wishes he was there yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. and then he fantasizes about fantasizes them. about yeah. them and but even in that like sorry to cut you yeah. but because you're talking about this I my favorite scene of the film is how when he gets so frustrated at Asrani the first time he <laughs> yeah. uh, properly meets him in that uh, like you know when he uh, cuts his date uh, yeah. with uh, uh, Vidya ji so jab hi wo jaate hai dono bar he imagines ki main isko bandook se uda dunga but he is oh. but see the beauty yeah. of this scene is ki uska aisa hai ki bandook se uda dunga he could have stopped there but he's like you know because imagination mebhi wo acha aadmi hai lekin ek court procedure bhi to hai uske paas to wo court mein भी गवाही दे रहा है कोर्ट में भी लॉयर है मैं इतना जोर जोर से हंस रही हूं लाइक दिस इज नॉट रियल दिस इज बेटर देन एनी पैरोडी आई हैव एवर सीन आई लव्ड इट लाइक आई फील लाइक ही इज द काइंड ऑफ गाय हु इफ ही एवर इमेजिन्स अबाउट हैविंग सेक्स विद अ गर्ल ही थिंक अबाउट यू नो अबॉर्शन या अबॉर्शन के लिए ठीक है उसको बच्चा रखना होगा तो ठीक है फिर 9 महीने का ये 6 महीने के प्रोटीन के लिए इसके न्यूट्रिशन के लिए मैं अक्रोट लेके आऊंगा हां बनाना भी लेके आऊंगा अरे बच्चे लेके बच्चे के बच्चे तो मोजे भी लगेगा ना ठीक है दादी जी को बुला लेंगे सो so, ये सब भी इसकी इमेजिनेशन का पार्ट है यू कैन इमेजिन दैट अ ब्रिलियंट ब्रिलियंट पिक्चराइजेशन यू कैन कंटिन्यू नो या एक्चुअली वी सॉ द क्राइम सीन जहां पे ये हत्या गैलरी है जिधर ये हत्या की जाती है जहांगीर आर्ट गैलरी बट आई थिंक द इंटरेस्टिंग पार्ट इज अबाउट द ड्रीम्स एंड आई आई वुड आल्सो कम टू दिस हिच पार्ट हिच हिच से पहले एक फिल्म थी जिसने वासुदा को प्रभावित किया था Uh, the the film that inspired Basuda to make choti si baat was the, the school for uh, the school for scoundrels school for scoundrels it was a british comedy yeah the, yeah, the yeah. british film school that was the film that inspired basuda and he also says that there was another film that uh, kind of inspired him hmm. the film see the secret life of walter mitty oh okay the 1970 yeah, yeah, yeah. N- the 1947 film yeah, yeah. not the, ni- the 2013 it, yeah. mm-hmm. not the 2013 is the same tak to shayad time machine aayi nahi thi thoda thoda shayad hi koi prabhavit hoga ha so the school for scoundrels and uh, the, the secret life of walter witty mm-hmm. witty uh, mm-hmm. Th- these were the inspirations mm-hmm. and isi ke sath agar aap dekhe jo dr nagendra nath hain mm-hmm. uh, julius nagendra nath uh, ashok kumar mm-hmm. colonel uh, colonel uh, jo bante hain that character is modeled on uh, dr potter from okay. school of scoundrels okay. uh-huh. to kafi sare isme reality check de raha hai wo aur mm-hmm. sath mein characters ki ek aur baat badi interesting hai jo prabhav ka character hai अभी प्रभा नाम क्यों रखा hmm. उसके पीछे भी एक अच्छी स्टोरी थी द स्टोरी इज प्रभा वाज आल्सो द लीड एक्ट्रेस इन सारा आकाश 
सारा आकाश का जो कैरेक्टर सारा आकाश वॉज वासुदास फर्स्ट फिल्म द लीड एक्ट्रेस नेम इन द फिल्म इज प्रभा इन पिया का घर दिस सेकेंड फिल्म शोभा सिस्टर दैट कैरेक्टर नेम इज प्रभा देन द सिनेमाटोग्राफर के के महाजन वाइफ वॉज प्रभा हु प्लेट कुमार शाहनी इज लीड इन माया दर्पण so so many prabha and even in, within the film the name yes. prabha has an importance because colonel ki bhi ek ek ek, ek zamane mein ex hua karti thi ex girlfriend was prabha and yeah. so yeah. abas yeah. how does it feel that a name has traveled more than both of us at least the name got somewhere yeah. so yeah uh, even even arun by yeah. the way arun ka jo naam hai arun pradeep hmm. film mein aap dekhe that was inspired by arun pradeep call arun call the filmmaker oh, okay. who was his closest friend basu chatterjee's closest friend and they kind of co-founded a film society called the film forum mm. in in bombay mm. so that was a tribute to arun call who made diksha nana patekar's oh. film which also won the national award i believe mm-hmm. and wow. nana patekar is one of the first and the finest works mm. so yeah that, these are the kind of connection that you kind of draw There was an Akashwani theater in yeah. Bombay where you said uh, there used to be a theater which used to play only these offbeat kind of films, which I did not know about. Yeah. So, so now coming to the second question, yeah, which is about yeah. the reception that uh, yeah. Basuda got. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so Basuda became, uh, as I said, a household name mm. when they came out with mm. Sara Akash. Mm. Sara Akash was not that famous because it was these films were also doing well, but maybe not as well as the Diwar or the Shoes. Yeah. Shodis. Right. Yeah. Okay. Because these were coming at the same time. Seventy four right. was Rajni Gandha. Right. Rajni Gandha was uh, released in Akashwani Theatre, which mm. was near Mantrale. Okay. Uh, in Bombay. in mumbai now sorry uh-huh. so, so, back then it was bombay so, yeah. so, back then it was bombay as it was mentioned in uh, this merry movie christmas. merry christmas yeah. the, uh, bombay back when mumbai the story is uh, placed in a time when it was called bombay yeah. mm. so we will we'll call it bombay sure. in this podcast yeah. because we are talking about 1970 yeah. ye bhi 70s ka podcast hai kya baat hai yeah sahi baat hai abhi yeah. just abhi, because i am on it abhi, just abhi <laughs> abhi hum durdarshan ke zamane mein hai yeah. तो आकाशवाणी थिएटर में इसको रिलीज मिला था दिस बिकेम अ बिग हिट एट वन पॉइंट ऑफ टाइम माय पेरेंट्स वॉच इट ऑन दूरदर्शन तो दूरदर्शन बिकेम एन अदर एजेंसी फ्रॉम विच दीज फिल्म गॉट पॉपुलराइज अमंग द पब्लिक क्योंकि वो जमाना हमारे जैसा जो अभी मल्टीप्लेक्स हो गया वैसा नहीं था सिंगल स्क्रीन थिएटर हुआ करते थे और बासुदा के क्योंकि कोई बड़े प्रोड्यूसर्स मिले नहीं सुरेश जिंदल मेड रजनी गंधा एंड देन राष्ट्रीय मेड पिया का घर बी आर चोपड़ा मेड दिस वन बी आर चोपड़ा मेड दिस वन वाजंट अ बिग डील क्या था अभी इट वाज बट इट वाज दे वर स्टार्टिंग आउट एंड दे वर यू नो इन द मिडिल ऑफ देयर दे बिकेम बिग नेम इन द 90s आई बिलीव विद सलमान भाई द वे यू प्रोनाउंस हिज नेम दैट्स हाउ यू नो ही इज जेन जी थोड़ा थोड़ा भिंड देते रहते हैं ना लोगों को ऑडियो प्लेटफार्म पे जो सुनेंगे उनके लिए तो सो सो व्हाट Suresh Jindal did in Rajni Gandha was they used to pitch it for the afternoon shows. Okay. In between two blockbuster, right. there was Rajni Gandha. Oh. So, if someone wants to see a show in the morning or evening, he will go on it. So, that's what he did. So, this became a big hit at mm-hmm. that time. Mm-hmm. Then, B R Chopra came in, mm-hmm. and uh, the film happened. Both Chitchor and Choti Si Baat. Choti Si Baat. And both became big hits. Mm-hmm. Then, Chitchor became a big hit. 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 Then, Chitchor He was very famous in the south but yeah. in the north in this this bollywood kind of bombay cinema mm. he became very famous Is it true that Bia Chopra was not happy with the first cut of uh, Choti Si Baat and he wanted to yeah. him to commercialize it a little more Yeah, yeah. so what happened was the, the the filmmaker Basuda was ready with the film Choti mm. Si Baat he showed he showed it to the Bia Chopra family both Mr and Mrs Chopra mm. watched it in their mm. private theater mm. दे सेड यार क्या ये फिल्म चलेगी नहीं मतलब समझ नहीं आ रहा ये तुम ऐसा करो मेरे पास स्कूल फॉर स्काउंटल्स की एक कॉपी है तुम उसे पकड़ो और पूरी छाप दो उसमें आप देखिए उसमें काफ़ी कम कॉम्प्लेक्सिटीज हैं अच्छा वो फिल्म में स्कूल फॉर स्काउंटल्स में जितने छोटी सी बात में है तो बासुदा ने कहा नहीं साहब देखिए मैंने फिल्म बना रखी है आप समझें थोड़ा सा थोड़ा देख लीजिए आप पैसे वाले आदमी हैं तो तो उन्होंने कहा नहीं भाई ये तो नहीं होगा और टेक द मनी एंड मेक तो बासुदा को लगा कि शायद ये मजाक कर रहे हैं ये चाह रहे हैं कि मैं पूरी फिल्म कैसे बनाऊँ आई कॉन्ट री शूट द एंटायर फिल्म दी थिंग इज डन सो चोपड़ा साहब को जाना था देहरादून पंद्रह बीस दिन की छुट्टी पे उन्होंने कहा मैं अपने शास्त्री हैं हमारे जो जो सेक्रेटरी हैं 
उनसे आप ले लीजिए पैसे मैं जा रहा हूँ देहरादून आप इसको फिर से बनाइए और सब करके तैयार रखिए मैं आऊँगा लौट के फिर हम देखेंगे सो मच फॉर नॉट रीडिंग द स्क्रिप्ट रेडी ही कुड हैव जस्ट रीड द स्क्रिप्ट एंड रिजेक्टेड इट देन एंड देयर इंस्टेड ऑफ वेटिंग टू सी द होल कट बट आई कंटिन्यू या नो नो सो ही वाज नॉट दैट क्लेवर आई थिंक दिस इज गोइंग टू बी द 2 सेकंड द द 4 सेकंड ट्रेलर टीजर ऑफ दिस एपिसोड नो सो व्हाट हैपेंड वाज अभी चैटर्जी बाबू बड़े चतुर चतुर थे हां उन्होंने कहा कि मैं शास्त्री जी के पास जाके पैसे ले लेता हूं and what he did was instead of reshooting the entire film he did the post production of the film and got the film released wow in the absence of <laughs> vr chopra dekho dekho chori bhi choti si baat hi hai <laughs> so so imagine uh, vr chopra ko pata chalta hai dehradun mein film release ho gayi ha uh-huh. and the first cut the first original film that was released in cinema Hmm. In the first release, there was no mention of B.R. Chopra as a producer. Oh. The logo of B.R. Films was not there in hmm. the first hmm. time it was released. Now, hmm. B.R. Chopra ne jab film dekhi, unhe pata chala ye to release kar gaya mere paise se. Uske baad B.R. Chopra ne telegram likha. Pehle telegram likha jata tha, hmm. Urjita. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so baade me. Wow. He, again, he is younger than Urjita. Wow. <laughs> टेलीग्राम में यू हैव टू राइट they used to charge just words ha huh? letter wise alphabet so alphabet ke hisab se so kisi ke pita ji bimar hain to unko likhna padta tha father ill come soon aisa samay tha to vr chopra ne likha happy proven wrong to vasudha oh nice after seeing choti si baat nice so vasudha's cleverness really worked out very well for him otherwise vasu ko fir kabhi vr chopra milte nahi yeah and also, then you also see zameer ka zameer poster zameer ka poster so many times on the bus yeah. stop the film. that yeah. was also produced also by bhr chopra, chopra ah. film yeah, yeah, yeah. so ek to first of all like you said uh, this is like a, a, everything that an angry young man stood for uska opposite hai ye film which is also what struck me uh, ki you know like a hindi film actor is supposed to be charming street smart macho and everything that amol palekar's character is not, not yeah. because i was like एंग्री एंग मैन के कितने मूवीज देखने के बाद बासु चैटर्जी ने सोचा होगा कि यार व्हाट अबाउट द मैन हु आर नॉट लाइक दिस डू वी नॉट डिजर्व लव क्या सो दिस कैरेक्टर आई फील मुझे यही जानना था कि यार इट मस्ट हैव बीन अ ब्रेथ ऑफ फ्रेश एयर नो इन लाइक दिस एल्फा मेल रिडन सिनेमा लाइक तभी वो टाइम लोगों का क्या रिएक्शन था आई आई वॉन्टेड टू आई एक्चुअली वॉन्ट टू अंडरस्टैंड जेंडर क्या था जेंडर रेशियो लाइक कौन से वॉट वॉज द टारगेट ऑडियंस ऑफ दिस फिल्म और आई आई एम गेसिंग औरतें ज़्यादा जा रही होगी ये फिल्म के लिए उस जमाने में हम बात करें नाइनटीन सेवेंटीज़ की तो उस जमाने में आई डोंट थिंक वेमेन यूज टू गो आउट दैट मच इन दैट इज एक्चुअली नॉट लाइक alone or in groups yeah. right it's a family audience yeah, right? it, yeah. Was, yeah. it was yeah. it was generally family audience. Yeah. Zami, yeah. Uh, Zanjeer, mm-hmm. film audience zameer zanjeer aur ye jo waqi film hai deewar i think it was watched mostly by the men hmm. right. men have been insecure about their masculinity for ages what now. are you yeah. saying you should know aapke aapke podcast ke liye you you can cut it and, <laughs> no no and, and, and very much very much no, but that is true there's nothing yeah. wrong with yeah, it yeah it is a patriarchal society sadly what? so अमोल पालेकर इन दिस न्यूज पेपर कट आउट लाइक लॉन्ग अगो वेन आई वॉज इन स्कूल अरे पापा बिकॉज माई डैड है same hairstyle yeah. and the mustache in college and right. unka bhi waisi get up tha kapde bhi waisi mm-hmm. pehente the pura same waisa hi tha and my dad was also very like shy nerdy kind of guy jo aise ladki aak to dekhte the but he is just like are aise kaise aise baat thodi na kar sakte ladki khud se baat karte na gharelu gharelu baat gharelu yeah so like uh, he also used to tell me that uh, uh, like aise uh, ladke kabhi uh, uh, jo ladka tumhe chhedega wo acha nahi rahega hai na and if you like a guy then there is nothing wrong with approaching him and yeah. so he comes from that so when i watched this film i was like ha i see that 
I see where this is coming from. So like my dad, uh, uh, like he also loved oh, Amul Palekar, and which is a shame. I should have watched his films thoda earlier. He didn't advocate <laughs> through this podcast. Yeah, Rujita, you he didn't will. advocate for him as strongly. But uh, but man, definitely. Like uh, I am guessing what time? My I was talking about my dad's friends. Tabi uh, right. girls and boys. Don't know their friends. The college time. Me and Obi, sat me jada jate the. So I remember. उन्होंने कहा था कि ऐसी कोई जब भी फिल्म आती थी रोमांटिक लव स्टोरी तभी लड़कियां बोलती थी कि जाना है दे यूज टू एक दम कि भाई चलो 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 सो बट या विच इज वाई वॉन्ट टू आस्क की लाइक ऑफकोर्स मतलब लड़कियां तो जाएंगी ये फिल्म के लिए अकेली नहीं जाएंगी बट आई एम गेसिंग विद पीपल वॉज इट स्टिल लाइक सो लाइक would it be fair to say that a diwar was a, or a shole was a masi film and this was more of an intellectual crowd film i think that has been there for all the art cinema kind of ऑडियंस इज वेरी लिमिटेड इट्स अ नीश ऑडियंस काइंड ऑफ अ थिंग छोटे बजट की फिल्में होती हैं काफी नॉर्मल सा स्क्रीन प्ले होता है बिकॉज इवन वेन दिस फिल्म स्टार्ट द ओपनिंग क्रेडिट्स आर प्लेइंग आउट थ्रू sounds of a typewriter type right yeah. and it's just yeah. plain text on 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 white background mm. uh even the costumes you mentioned the costumes like again i'm going back to diwar because that's like the closest film yeah. time wise we've discovered mm. i'm like why aren't amul palkar's bell bottoms bell bottoming like amitabh bachchan's <laughs> bell bottoms <laughs> uh avidya sinha sarees like yeah. i was watching it with a female it was like sarees. you can still wear a saree like that yeah. whereas yeah, if you yeah. watch any costume from diwar it's a very of its time kind yeah. of costume Correct. design ke wo us waqt but also wo time ke kapde abhi wapas aaye 10 saal pehle wo same saadi nahi chalti thi 10 saal pehle wo low cut blouse thoda sleeveless blouse fashion mein tha isme meri expertise kam hai ha wo ye hota hai aksar wo dujita is like you should have more female guests because when <laughs> when she talks about ha- uh, hair styling and costumes yeah. then she is the expert nahi nahi dekhi main 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 amol palikar jaise kapde pehenta hu dekh rahe hai yahan pe ek hi opinion milega main amol palikar jaise kapde pehenta hu to fit in hone ke liye aaj main t-shirt pehenta hu asrani shirts sometimes i was like hey, oh, yeah. these shirts would still fly like yeah, yeah. totally yeah, yeah. Okay, Asrani, I just want to ask. Yes. Okay, <laughs> Asrani, first of all, what a baller, what a guy. Yeah. Okay, never have I ever seen him in this light. I mean, I was like, "Are you? Am I? Sh- are you sure he's the same guy? Just like, Bijli, ऐसे बात करता है, ऐसे तंग करता है heroes को. But uh, Asrani, I feel. So, what do you think? Was his character supposed to be like the charming, charming guy, or was he supposed to be the villain, villain? Because okay, to give you context, uh, have you guys seen Humpty Sharma's Dulhaniya? Yeah. You have seen Humpty. Have you seen Humpty Sharma's Dulhaniya? I think Dulhaniya? I have. Yeah. So, usme in that film also, right? This is the one with Ayushman Khurana. No, no, no. Humpty okay. Sharma is Varun Dhawan and Aliya Bhatt. वो उनका है movie. तो उसमें भी Varun Dhawan is this Nalla guy, ठीक है? Who Aliya is in love with. Yeah. And Aliya के बाप जो है, he finds another guy for her, who's played by the late Siddharth. and uh, so so that is supposed to be the charming dude Correct. he has like matlab charming hai street smart hai acche ghar ka hai so even in that film it is very obvious that siddharth is a clear cut choice so that i wanted to understand what in this film was asrani also supposed to be the clear cut choice ki like of course he is better than him but still she went with love can can i add something before you answer yeah wasn't the whole point that that even in, in Basu Chatterjee's film even the villain is not a villainish villain of course yeah you, yeah, yeah. you don't want uh, like you don't want gabbar to jump on asrani's uh, chest with spiked <laughs> shoes like he's not that kind of a villain yeah, but yeah. but please tell us what you Th- think uh, that's why we call him the 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 painter of the normal painter of the normal because it's ah, the okay. everyday life that right. he right. shows right हमारी जिंदगी में भी काफी विलन होते हैं मुझे मेरा बगल वाला बिल्कुल पसंद नहीं है <laughs> लेकिन बगल वाला अब्बास पसंद नहीं है <laughs> हाँ okay, ये इनके exactly. बारे में कुछ नहीं बोल सकता <laughs> रोजी का सवाल है रोजी रोटी वाली <laughs> अब्बास क्या आप भी दही वड़े मंगाते हैं <laughs> <laughs> तो यू नो द यू हैवेंट सीन गोलमाल उसमें उसी में है ना ये वो तुझे दही बड़े खाने का मन हो रहा है पगली तुझे तो प्यार हो गया है हमारी जिंदगी में जैसे हमें जिनसे कुंठा होती है मतलब जेलिसी होती है You're not supposed to curse on this. तोबा तोबा तोबा. Jealousy, jealousy का मैं मतलब जानना चाह रहा था. तो जिनको jealousy होती है किसी से. Yeah. तो I think वो jealous character दिखाने के लिए किया गया है. बाकी I think I relate to Asrani the most. Wow. Really. Being a single guy. <laughs> right. Twenty three. <laughs> <laughs> 
Asrani is the only one who can't get a girl in Basudas film. Yeah. अच्छा पहले भी किसी फिल्म में बातों बातों में if you see. And then छोटी सी बात बातों बातों में इनकी बात क्या कि बात बात नहीं बढ़ रही है. दोनों वाह उसमें बस Asrani की बात नहीं हुई. Yeah. बाकी सब को मिल गया. पर Amol Palekar को तो मिल ही गया दोनों जगह. But so, we spoke about um, the iconic year that uh, 1975 was for Amitabh Bachchan. Yeah. Here is 1975 for Asrani. And again, is me 1975. छोटी सी बात 1975 में include किया गया because maybe like you said this yeah. got the censor certificate. Here are the films he did in 1975. Asrani, Mili, छोटी सी बात, Rafu Chakkar, Shole, Chupke Chupke. Wow. Right? All iconic films. Correct. Uh, and I was thinking about this. So he, this is also the like a year before he's doing हम अंग्रेजों के ज़माने के जेलर इन शोले, which is like your quintessential yeah. over the top comedic role. Correct. Mm. And then he's doing a substantial part in this Basu Chatterjee film. Mm. So these kind of films were also like known for giving character actors more more screen time, right? Mm. Asrani, I think, was also mm. very much trained actor. He right. has a training in acting. He's yeah. a F F I I trained. FDI, yeah. Uh, at that time it was FII because oh, really? television to us zamane mein tha nahi tha nahi so it was called the film institute this is why we call film historians on our oh, episode guys so damn. they can fact yeah. check us damn <laughs> so jaya bahadur you also graduated from yeah. FII, FII, FII not, not FTI FII. wow FTI I came in much later I think 70 because 82 में हमारे यहाँ टेलीविजन सेट आया एशियाट के टाइम पे जब इंडिया में एशियन गेम्स हुआ था पहली बार टूर्स बाय दैट लॉजिक नाउ इट शुड बी कॉल्ड FTO आया है फिर तो खराब हो जाएगा सिस्टम अच्छा मतलब अभी तक ठीक है काफी हाँ अभी तक ठीक ठाक है लेकिन एफ आई आई से पढ़ के आया था असरानी एंड ही वॉज वन ऑफ द बेस्ट आई थिंक कैरेक्टर एक्टर्स ऑफ दैट टाइम उससे पहले जो मुझे कैरेक्टर एक्टर याद आते हैं वो ओम प्रकाश है इन ऑलमोस्ट ऑल द कॉमेडियन चुपके चुपके के जीजा जी नहीं नहीं वो तो फिर आई थिंक डेविड है देन द ओम प्रकाश इज द आओ हमारे होटल में चाय पियो जी गरम गरम वाला एक्टर एंड यस चुपके चुपके में द द जीजा इज ओम प्रकाश यस कैसे क्यों बात करते हो अरे वो भाग्यवान यस दैट 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 इज एंड देन सिमिलर लुकिंग वाज डेविड बोथ लुक लाइक दे लुक लाइक यू तो नंदिनी ठाकुर इन दिस फिल्म नंदिता ठाकुर हु प्ले दैट सखी ऑफ विद्या सिन्हा छोटी सी विद्या सिन्हा को कभी भी कुछ बात करनी होती है वो लड़की के पास आती है अमोल डिड नॉट है दैट काइंड ऑफ अ फ्रेंड फ्रेंड डू है रूम मेट बट वो रूममेट के साथ ओपन नहीं है बस रूममेट का एक योगदान है अमोल जल्दी निकलो वो सो गए क्या अरुण मुझे भी ऑफिस जाना है जब वो नहा रहा है अनादर अनादर मूवी व्हिच टॉक्स अबाउट मेल अकेला था अपनी लाइफ में दैट ही हैड टू लाइक फाइंड फ्रेंडशिप इन अंटोरी बट इट्स नॉट माई ऑटोबायोग्राफी गाई I wonder why you've connected so hard with it, uh, yeah, Ishan. Yeah. But uh, we have to go to a break. I want to ask one last thing. So, despite this, despite the fact that Asrani is doing comical roles in uh, mainstream films, he's doing more here. We still see Dharmendra Hema Malini, Amitabh Bachchan does a cameo. Like these are the biggest names of that time. Yeah. Hmm. What relationship did Basu have with those actors? That, that he w- they were not the leads in his films, hmm. yeah. but they were still happy to appear for a song or a scene. Hmm. Yeah, I think because of the the reputation he had made with Chitchur, hmm. especially hmm. because. Mm. Just your broke all records mm. of art cinema at that mm. time, mm. so everybody wanted to be in Basuda films. Oh. And then Dharmendra did a film with Basuda later on. Mm. Okay. Even uh, you know uh, in Rajni Gandha, uh, the the story goes the original cast was not Dinesh Thakur uh, and uh, the Amol Palekar and Vidya Sinha. The real cast that Basu wanted to cast in the film was Shashi Kapoor. then sharmila oh. tagore and aparna sen and maybe amitabh bachchan that was the kind of mm. story that so was it here. purely monetary reasons that they would not opt for these films uh, so shashi kapoor as pointed by the author anirudh bhattacharjee in his film shashi kapoor said you have to call it shashi kapoor's film not your basuda film oh, okay if you want me in the film mm. that's mm. very weird <laughs> yeah <laughs> but so, not unbelievable yeah. Yeah, yeah this was the commercial cinema that Correct. because those actors were at the peak of their career mm. 
mm. and they were doing film that they thought was not up to the mark mm. that was some art kind of film mm. they were the commercial hits of that time mm. but uh, hema manli dharmendra did the film later on uh, and amitabh bachchan also as you said was featured in the film yeah. not just as on the himself. poster yeah, yeah as himself <laughs> and people think that it was he was shooting for zameer at that time mm. in reality he was shooting for farar okay uh, when he came for that cameo and it was uh, across the studio the next studio he was working to yaar mujhe ye puchna tha sorry yeah yeah mujhe ye puchna tha ki मतलब इज इट जस्ट मी और डू यू ऑल्सो थिंक वो कैमियो काफी ज्यादा कैजुअल लगा मतलब मुझे लगता है इट वाज मेंट टू बी बट मुझे लगता है थोड़ा और मेहनत हो सकती थी ओके नहीं मैं आई फील धर्मेंद्र मतलब ठीक है आई अंडरस्टैंड अमिताभ कैमियो उसको बस उनको बस चल के आना था और बात करनी थी इट्स लाइक इफ शाहरुख खान शोड अप इन मैरी क्रिसमस यू वुडंट इवन नीड हिम टू से एनीथिंग लाइक व्हाट शाहरुख खान अरे कहां से आ गया नहीं 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 आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट द सॉन्ग सो अभी शाहरुख खान का एग्जांपल लिया है तो शाहरुख खान मेड अ कैमियो इन हे बेबी आल्सो दैट वाज लाइक वन ऑफ हिज मोस्ट आइकॉनिक कैमियो he entered in the song dil da mamla hai dil par to usme bhi unhone kapde pehne acche se you know uh, suitable to the scene and whatever was happening over there at that right. time he koi kisi ki to shaadi ya engagement thi to unhone shaadi wale kapde pehne he is also dancing he is also lip syncing like no where do you feel like if you watch that movie out of context you won't even consider ki iska cameo hoga but waisa in dono ko dekh ke lag raha hai inka cameo hai so ki kya that... kaafi casual hai dharmendra ji yeah. ko effort nahi dal rahe aise ped ko aise jaane man jaane man bhai bhaji ne bhi काफी कैजुअल घर पे पहनने वाली साड़ी पहनी है सो शी हैजंट इवन डन अर हेयर आई फील ऐसी मतलब वो पहन के आ गई है तो व्हाट डू यू थिंक लाइक बाय वाज दिस व्हाई सो मच कैजुअल सो वासुदा डिडंट वांट द सॉन्ग टू बी इन द फिल्म ओ वासुदा वाज नॉट द काइंड ऑफ फिल्म मेकर हु वांटेड सॉन्ग्स इन द फिल्म लाइक हिरानी देन टुडे इज हिरानी आई हैव वॉच डंकी सो हैव वी नो बिकॉज़ हिरानी आल्सो उनको कि बहुत सारे इज अ वाना बी ऋषिकेश मुखर्जी आई एम बट आई बट आई हैव सीन सो मेनी ऑफ हिज इंटरव्यूज एंड उनको कोई भी इंटरव्यू पूछता है ना कि वन थिंग दैट यू रिग्रेट पुटिंग इन द फिल्म व्हिच इन हाइंडसाइट यू वुड हैव एडिटेड ही ऑलवेज मेंशंस द सॉन्ग्स ही इज लाइक कि छन छन की जरूरत नहीं थी मुन्ना भाई एमबीबीएस में तो थ्री इडियट्स में भी जुवी डुबी की जरूरत नहीं थी सो this i have seen so i something yeah. like that hirani no. also from fti by the way yes uh, one of the best <laughs> yeah. of fti product <laughs> so in uh, so what happened was he was one of the three um, trinity of the middle of the road cinema first being rishida yeah. the other was gulzar and then uh, basuda mm. gulzar loved music in his films mm. andhi ka koi bhi gana aap lijiye dil dhoonta mm. hai fir wahi fursat ke raat din oh. ऐसे कई सारे गीत उनके फिल्मों में है ऋषिकेश दा की फिल्में भी सिर्फ एक या दो गाने आनंद आप शायद यू नो आप डिस्कस करेंगे कभी ना कभी उसमें देखिए एक एक दो गाना है जो आपको याद रह जाता है वासुदा के फिल्म में ही नेवर वांटेड सॉन्ग्स ही यूज सॉन्ग्स इन द बैकग्राउंड न जाने क्यों अगर आप देखें इट प्लेज इन द बैकग्राउंड रजनीगंधा में भी द सॉन्ग प्लेज इन द बैकग्राउंड जब वो लोग कैब में होते हैं सो the the producer wanted the the storyline yeah. demanded commerce ke, versus haan, art commercial. a battle as old yeah. as cinema par par movie bechenge kaise gana yeah. to hona yeah. chahiye yeah. kuch yeah. to hona chahiye and then he added in the end he added the cast of the film to be replaced uh, with uh, dharmendra and hema mali in the song okay. to amol palekar aap dekhte hain beech gaane mein amol palekar aa jata hai screen pe yeah, and yeah. Yeah, romances yeah, yeah. with uh, vidya yeah. sinha yes. okay we'll take a quick break when we come back i want to talk about some of the more problematic aspects of the film yeah. uh, the second half <laughs> the second half main apne notes nikal liya hu so yeah if you're watching us on youtube please uh, like the video subscribe to the ibm pop channel and share this video with uh, whoever you think will enjoy this if, if you're listening to us on an audio platform Form, please rate and review us we'll see you right on the other side of this break hey hey it's been another great week on the ivm podcasts network on cyrus says cyrus is joined by actor chunky pande he talks about his upcoming projects and how his parents encouraged him to be an actor he also talks about meeting akshay kumar his interaction with the legend kishor kumar and the future of cinema On Has It Aged Well Abbas that's me and Urjita are joined by comedian and writer Gursimran Khamba to talk about the Shahrukh Khan star Phir Bhi Dil Hai Hindustani tune in to find out whether the satire of the film still holds up and what the film tells us about the state of news media folks if you like our shows spread the word tell your friends and don't forget to rate and review them wherever you're listening to them follow us on social media we are IVM podcasts on Twitter Facebook Instagram and LinkedIn 
You'll also find all our shows on youtube.com slash IVM podcasts. And finally, we would like to thank our sponsors this week. Omidyar Network India, IDFC First Bank and ICICI Prudential Mutual Fund. Thank you for making this possible. And we are back on Hazard Age. Well, we're talking about Choti Si Baat from 1976. In the studio with me is Urjita and our guest Ishan Sharma. Uh, <laughs> we were briefly talking about the music before we went into the break. So just want to mention Salil Chaudhary did the music for this film. Uh, one of the most well-known and legendary musicians of the time. Uh, so Ishan, let's put you put you on the spot. Kya? Put all three of us on the spot. Ke this film, to our film, is very distinctly... Uh, divided into two halves yeah. right? mm. the, the first half is what we associate with Basu Chatterjee yeah. the feel good bomb the pining the yearning the, the yearning yeah. the 70s the simple yeah. uh, no joke of love yeah. and all of that and then the film takes sort of a hard turn yeah. and then very hard uh, turn and then Arun our character in order to get the love of his life finds this character uh, from somewhere who's based in Khandala uh, whose name is uh, I have noted it down very secular name uh, Colonel Julius Nagindranath Wilfred Singh <laughs> Okay. By the way, the company Arun works in is also called Jackson Tolaram. Uh, yeah. So very funny names. And then when Arun meets Colonel Saab, yeah. Colonel Saab lays out some of the most alpha shit that I have ever yeah. <laughs> seen in any film, where it goes back to the same thing. You have to be um, manly and you have to show the other guy. It's a very hard. How do you Very hai? great Urdu word rakib, which, yeah. which is which, I don't think which has a comparison in 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 English, yeah. where it's the person who. The person you like likes. Hmm. So how to put the rakib down and how to be the one-upmanship. And when Arun comes back to Bombay, I feel like he itna acha sida sada ladka tha. Isko asshole bana ke jo bhi jaaye Colonel Saab ne. And Colonel Saab is there at every point to see him do display his ass holiness. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. So what and, and that's the one part where I'm like now this is where we have to ask the question has it aged well because yeah. some of those parts have not right. Yeah. Colonel Saab's range of Misogyny goes from how to disrobe a woman to how to eat with chopsticks. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So, yeah. so when you look back at that, actually I should ask with you, Jita, when you look back at that, how, what do you feel? So like while watching the first half, right, I made six points about mm. how this movie is so good, how this movie challenges the alpha <laughs> male. And then I made the second half, I made all delete kar because, <laughs> because I was like, we were not understanding what the director wanted to say. We were just thinking about the progressive man. But no, after the second half, I made the second half, I am still like torn between hmm. like two thoughts. My first thought is that ek to, the obvious one that he is saying that this is how you should win a girl the way it is laid out. Hmm. And the second thought is that it's kind of a parody in itself. That hmm. he is saying ki, dekho, matlab, yeah, alpha yeah. male bante nahi hai, banaye jate. Yeah. That is what he is trying hmm. to say ki, uh, ye jo tum dekhte ho, jo ye angry young man bana phirta hai Amitav, <laughs> ye, ye bana bana hai, thik hai? Aise londe hote nahi hai. Aapko kya lagta hai? Amul palakar zindagi bar aise aise chalega. Chopstick se kaega. Nahi, shadi hote hi <laughs> <laughs> so, so my thing is that is is that what he's trying to say which I hope he is yeah. but it wasn't clear I still like try to look for cues I'm like I, I was holding on to strings dude right. when Asrani said that you have made it like this do you think it's like this I thought like okay yeah, yeah now 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 no, but nothing yeah. so Ishan? what do you think uh, I'm going to get water I'm going to get water I'm going to get लेकिन ये फिल्म में काफी सारे प्रॉब्लमेटिक सीन्स है सिर्फ यही नहीं आप स्टार्टिंग में देखिए स्टॉकिंग सबसे पहला तो वही आ जाता है लेकिन आई थिंक द मोरलिटी ऑफ बासुदा कम्स इन With, in the form of Vidya Sinha. Okay. Mm-hmm. Vidya Sinha is defending uh, the boy. When Nandita asks him, why do you do something about this? And if you look at a scene where sh- 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 Amol Palikar is following her to Khar, his house, an auntie comes in front of him, and he goes back. And he goes back. And then the auntie Vidya Sinha asks him, Prabha, why do you do this with the police? He says, yes, I'll Kar do this haan. whenever. Haan. Hmm. फिर जब ही वो ऑफिस जाती है जैक्सन तुलाराम के yeah, yeah, yeah. मैनेजर से मिलने hmm. तो बिचारे की बहुत हालत खराब होती है, है। हाँ, सोचा था फटना <laughs> नहीं बोलना इधर 
इसलिए मैंने बोला हिस्टोरियन के मुंह से ऐसे शब्द अच्छे नहीं लगते शोभा नहीं देते शोभा नहीं देते तशरीफ फट गई थी तशरीफ में थोड़ी सी अनकम्फर्टेबल चीजें हो रही थी तशरीफ में थोड़ी सी दरार आने की आशंका दिख रही थी आशंका तो वो एक सीन है जिसमें वो कहता है मैं तो बहुत अच्छा आदमी हूँ मेरा ऐसा कोई इरादा नहीं था तुम तो शिकायत मत करो बड़ी दिक्कत हो जाएगी कैरेक्टर सर्टिफिकेट आप चाहिए तो कैरेक्टर सर्टिफिकेट चाहिए तो तो आई थिंक ही वाज ट्राइंग टू प्रोवाइड रिलीफ टू द द द टेंशन दैट वाज बिल्डिंग इन सम ऑफ द सीन्स सेम इन द सीन दैट यू मैंशन असरानी बोल रहा है बचाने के लिए सो आई थिंक दिस इज वॉट वासुदा हेज डन दैट ही हेज सेव्ड हिमसेल्फ फ्रॉम द फ्रॉम गेटिंग अब्यूस्ड और मे बी उनको जो भी गाली पढ़नी है उससे बचने के लिए मैं शब्द ढूंढ रहा हूँ क्या कैसे मैं इसको साझा करूँ ऑल्सो लाइक वी हैब्लिश लाइक वी सेट दैट बैक देन अगेन द फिल्म वॉचिंग ऑडियंस वॉज प्री डोमिनेटली मेल सो अगेन आई थिंक फॉर नाइनटीन सेवेंटी सिक्स दिस वॉज जस्ट लाइक देखें एक एक मज़ेदार और बात है If you watch, because it is said that it is based on school for scoundrels. Correct. Huh? In that film, you can't remember the lead actress's profession. वो कहाँ काम कर रही थी, क्या कर रही थी. We don't see that. Mm-hmm. Either we know Vidya Singh is a working professional, जो कि खुद जाती है खार से South Bombay bus से सफर कर रही है. तो I think in that sense he has saved himself from mm-hmm. that accusations that is. placed upon him on stalking and other things mm-hmm. about this scene the second part mm-hmm. that is i think there's no defense the of that scene? the sari scene yeah. <laughs> because i was shocked to see that <laughs> and i was shocked how censor board did not object to that mm. and they objected to shocking jisme aisa koi scene nahi hai mm. shocking is his only adult film mm. and this was not shocking is about three elder men the trying three elder to men, patao yeah. younger women Not the news shockings. The, the, yeah, the, the, the original the, one. The OG shocking. Which also starred uh, Ashok Kumar. Ashok Kumar, yeah, A.K. Yeah. Angal, and the other fellow. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, so I think उसमें कोई saving grace नहीं है end में. So, but tell me something. So, the, sorry, yeah. the most unrealistic thing about that whole scene was that uh, in his imagination. when she tells the uh, boss ki isne mujhe is ye mujhe stalk kar raha hai he actually takes action yeah, <laughs> yeah. which doesn't happen in real life yeah. uh, as we know it Ouch. <laughs> dreams dreams in real life boss bolta hai ki koi nahi aaj se nahi karega that's how it ends usually but yeah. anyway yeah. on. let's not get real here <laughs> and so uh, the climax arun doesn't actually no, do that right he so mm-hmm. like somewhere in the back of the morality he, the morality yeah, the like morality comes in kahin pe usne bhi ek line kheech di ki ye भले ही मैंने प्रैक्टिस में yeah. किया हो मैं उसमें नहीं आई थिंक विद दिस प्लॉट एंड दिस काइंड ऑफ कैरेक्टराइजेशन द अनफोल्डिंग ऑफ द कैरेक्टर्स ही कुड हैव मेड अ गुड क्राइम फिल्म स्टॉकिंग इज फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल अ बिग क्राइम वन कुड डू जैसे वो कौन सी कहानी फिल्म है और कौन कौन सी फिल्में हैं यू कैन डू एन नंबर ऑफ फिल्म विद दैट काइंड ऑफ थिंग देन दिस होल थिंग विद अनिंग ऑफ सारी एंड थिंग्स आर हैपनिंग बहुत कुछ हो सकता था बट बासुदा चोज नॉट टू डू दैट बट टू शो द बेटर साइड ऑफ अमोल पालेकर क्योंकि वो ब्लैक एंड वाइट तो हर इंसान में है वन कुड बी अ वेरी गुड मैन बट विद अ वेरी डार्क माइंड तो तो आई थिंक दैट्स द मोरलिटी क्वेश्चन कम्स इन इज द कर्नल कैरेक्टर लाइक अफ टाइप पर्सन बिकॉज ही हैज लाइक अ पॉसी ऑफ थ्री वीमेन हु आर जस्ट हैंगिंग आउट विद हिम uh so is he like supposed to be that and and why ashok kumar like i don't think ashok kumar had a uh, image of like a shocking <laughs> no <laughs> he had a very good sanskari like, image he is essentially sexy sam from kabhi alvida yeah. ka na sort of he had a very uh, wo alok image, alok right? kon the that aloknath aloknath kind uh, of image uh, babuji babuji kind uh, of image at one time so he was cast against type या इट वॉज हिज फर्स्ट बासुदा फिल्म एंड देन ही डिट शॉकिन जिसमें तो पूरा ही उनका कैरेक्टर बदल गया एंड ही वॉज नोट फॉर अदर थिंग्स देन एक्टिंग बट या आई थिंक अशोक कुमार डिड प्रिटी गुड इन द काइंड ऑफ कैरेक्टर दैट ही गॉट ही कुड बी अ रूथलेस जर्क हु वॉज अ मिसोजिनिस्ट इन द फिल्म ही इज टेलिंग पीपल हाउ टू do that and uh, asrani who is ac- accusing uh, ashok kumar in the film ke bhai tumne hamare ladke ko kya kar diya wo baad mein usi ke paas jata hai yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. so kyunki insani fitrat hai yeah. hum wo because basuda talks about reality hmm. reality mein waise log hote hain and most of the film, people who watch the film were like that maybe hmm. jo auraton ke bare mein wo samajhte honge ki auraton aisi hi hoti hain 
इसमें औरत ने वो विक्टिम कार्ड जैसा कुछ नहीं है इसमें शी इज नॉट गोइंग टू कम्प्लेन अबाउट द बॉय बट शी इज प्लेइंग अलॉन्ग शी इज मेकिंग द फर्स्ट मूव सो लाइक द इंटरेस्ट इज शोन फ्रॉम द स्टार्ट इट सेल्फ लाइक इट्स नॉट लाइक शी इज अनोन एंड आई लाइक हाउ थोड़ा सा ही क्यों ना हो बट एटलीस्ट उन्होंने उसका पीओवी भी दिखाया yeah. हुआ है कि वो भी अपनी सहेली से बात शी ऑल्सो हैज अ लाइफ ऑफ अर ओन शी ऑल्सो उसका भी दिखाया हुआ है पर्सपेक्टिव कि व्हाट शी थिंक्स ऑफ द गाय शी इज नॉट जस्ट शोन फ्रॉम हिज पर्सपेक्टिव वो yeah. ऐसा नहीं बस बस स्टॉप टू बस स्टॉप हमें दिखाई दे रहे हैं एंड यू नो थोड़ा अकेडमिक अगर हम जाएँ लॉरा मलवी का एक आर्टिकल है बहुत अच्छा ऑन विजुअल कल्चर्स विच वेर शी टॉक्स अबाउट द मेल गेज दिस फिल्म इज रिटन बाय अ मेल बासुदा रोड द फिल्म स्क्रीन प्ले बाय by Vasuda hmm. the music is by a male hmm. the lyrics is by a male yogesh hmm. kyunki humne salil da ki baat ki yogesh ki baat yogesh ka bhi zikr bahut zaruri hai then uh, the the additional dialogues were by uh, sharad joshi hmm. then uh, the commentary was by kamleshwar the writer who wrote kitne Who's pakistan the hmm. yeah. yeah and then you have this whole male gaze coming in okay. yeah. how male perceive women characters hmm. women voice is the male's voice Hmm. so that's how we have to see the film right. hmm. that there is a male writing it mm-hmm. similarly jill jill soloway hmm. wrote a piece and where she talk, where he talked about this whole idea of uh, a female gaze hmm. how females when they write story how they perceive male characters yeah. for example sai paranje pe and uh, chashme badur yeah. the three yeah. boys yeah. Yeah. and one girl yeah. hmm. here you have two boys one girl yeah. yeah so we have to see through those lenses right. then we'll understand how and why he put that misogynist yeah. kind of scenes in the film because he was he was telling us maybe that this is the kind of thing that goes around when Men boys think about women yeah, yeah. abhi abhi hum use compare nahi kar sakte kabir singh ke animal yeah, ke yeah, sath yeah, yeah. kyunki of course yeah, yeah. wo to uske hisab se to ye sandeep ji there's a difference between creating a boys locker room kind of environment and actually showing this is what happens in the boys locker yeah. room hmm. very different yeah. two different things उसके हिसाब से तो बहुत सती सावित्री बहुत बहुत सती सावित्री बट या उसके पाप धुल नहीं जाते वी हैव टू पॉइंट आउट दैट देयर वर थिंग्स प्रॉब्लमेटिक विद दिस व्हिच इज व्हाई द शो इज कॉल्ड हैज इट इन शान या इट इज हैज एज नोबडी विल से कि यू हैव अ वेरी नाइस पेल्विस दे विल द मोस्ट दैट दे से इज कि कि आप हमारे बच्चों की मां बनोगी दैट्स हाउ दैट्स हाउ दे विल प्रपोज प्रभा मैंने डिसाइड कर लिया है तुम मेरी पत्नी बनोगी बट यू वांट टू टॉक अबाउट ड्रीम्स ड्रीम्स इंपोर्टेंस ऑफ इन इन दिस फिल्म मैंने या बिकॉज़ हमने इस पॉडकास्ट एपिसोड में भी बहुत सारे ड्रीम का जिक्र बट नो एवरी सिंगल टाइम ही वुड zone out of his fantasy it was a yeah. laugh laugh moment so yeah, yeah i really yeah. Like and that. that that is inspired from that's how you know that this is a product of two influences mm-hmm. this day dreaming sequence is inspired from the secret life of walter mitty mitty yeah mm-hmm. isme walter mitty is day dreaming mm-hmm. mm-hmm. so isme jab bhi wo dream kar raha hai aap dekhen he is dreaming in south bombay <laughs> he <laughs> lives in uh, the bandra. other part bandra ah. yeah but he he dreams in south bombay <laughs> right Don't we all? <laughs> yeah, yeah, because that's the the Bombay of his dream of Basuda's Kare. dream. Yeah. Uh, Tabhi kya bandra kar badi cheez nahi the kya wo. They were. Nahi, wo zamane mein nahi. Agar aap baato baato mein dekhe where uh, Amul Palekar and Tina Muni were sitting, that's the bandra bands and that as we know it yeah, today. Yeah, yeah. Uh. Us zamane mein kuch bhi nahi tha wahan pe. <laughs> yeah. There was yeah. a few buildings here and there. But even like talking about the Mumbai of uh, you know those th- that of that time. Uh-huh. I love seeing I love revisiting old films just to see I how Mumbai yeah, looked yeah. like yeah. back so then. So beautiful. Like and I read it in an article also that uh, uh, this was the Mumbai of dreams that was planned to a whole generation. Yeah. That this is what a dream city looks like. You know bade bade Jo pan out hona tha. क्या क्या जो पैन आउट होना था द ड्रीम दैट हैव बीन द रियलिटी या बट दिस वाज नॉट बड़े बड़े सड़कें यू नो एंबेसडर गाड़ियां और बीच में एक दो टांगे है ना <laughs> और होटल भी है पानी पूरी का ठेला भी है yeah. आपकी इनकम के हिसाब से जो आपको सही और हवा भी है है ना कोई मास्क भी नहीं पहना वहां पे तो ओके सिंस यू बॉट अप बॉम्बे अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग आई फॉरगॉट टू मेंशन सो सरोवर the restaurant samovar samovar sorry yeah. the restaurant in jahangir art gallery yeah. plays a very big part correct mm-hmm. and there is a particular chicken dish that yeah. is that is asrani's favorite huh. called chicken ala poors huh. uh, ishan tell us the 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 story behind that dekhiye chicken ala poors itna prasiddh ho gaya tha ki peter ko asal mein job chhod ke jana pada peter ko as it was peter the the chef so he has a peter 
Alapuza uh, what is Alapuza is it a name of a place or something in 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 Kerala Kerala yeah By the way, मैंने वो मेन्यू का फोटो निकाला जो नहीं नहीं लिखा है का सॉरी सबसे कम प्राइस तुमने कम प्राइस तुमने कब देखे थे Like अभी in my experience in my life, I remember vada pav. I have lived in that era where vada pav was four rupees in my school. Four rupees, I have dead rupee ka kaha. Ha, dead rupee. Then samosa sandwich. Samosa three rupee ka. Yeah, same same thing. Then sandwich bhi thirty rupees ka. But that's ka. Delhi rates, right? Kanpur rates. Kanpur. <laughs> <laughs> sandwich bhi pandra bhi twenty rupees ka kaha hai maine proper grilled sandwich. Yeah, but dead rupee ka vada pav I remember. Dead rupee ka vada pav. That's like the cheapest yeah. thing I can remember. in school maine 50 rupees ki mango bite khai hai does that aata hai wo count hota hai does that count of course 50 rupees 50 paise the 50 paise the do aati thi ek rupee mein mango bite yeah yeah abhi sir for you you remember the cheapest thing you ate oh 25 paise sir aur abhi sir hamare time pe sab free mein tha barter system thi hamare time pe but some over shut down recently and it ran out of business the you also mentioned the restaurants of bombay that are in this film and there's one bandra restaurant that you tried finding pomposh 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 restaurant jahan pe jo mathura se wo jo do clerks hain un wo milte hain wo film ke starting mein introduction mein aap dekhiye तो ये है मिस्टर माथुर और इनकी वाइफ ये लोग मिलते हैं बेंड्रा के रेस्टोरेंट में तो अभी कौन से वाले हैं अभी भी रेस्टोरेंट चालू अभी फ्लोरा है आई थिंक फ्लोरा इज आल्सो नाउ दे दे हैव क्लोज्ड व्हाट इज द नेम ऑफ द रेस्टोरेंट आई थॉट इट सिंग फ्लोरा फाउंटेन नो 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 फ्लोरा इन वर्ली ओके बट Yeah, it's still, it's there. still there. Huh. So, I think that's Chinese, the only yes, place, yes. the the first Chinese okay. restaurant, Big I think, Chinese, of this huh, part. Huh. Then, okay. and one part you see Nanking restaurant also on mm. Marine Lines. Yeah. Mm. So I think, uh, uske alawa sare band ho chuke. Some over shut down. Some over band ho gaya, pumpoosh band ho gaya. Then there is a scene from Taj also in okay. the film. Mm. Yeah. क्रेडिट रोल अगर आप फिर से देखें स्टार्टिंग में ही फेज ही ही गिव्स एक्नोलेजमेंट टू द लोकेशन उसमें ताज का भी एक लोकेशन है आई वांट टू नो वेयर डिड दे शूट इट व्हाट वाज दैट प्लेस यू हैवंट बीन एबल टू फिगर आउट नो मुझे ताज में एंट्री कम है गरीब आदमी को नहीं मिलता है उधर जाना चाय अभी वो कितने की मिलती है मेरे स्कूल में 600 रुपए की है मैं ट्राई किया था जाने का ओके बट दिस इज यू हैव टू गो फॉर द हाई टी राइट या 1800 रुपीस बिकॉज़ मेरे स्कूल के टाइम मतलब 10 साल पहले 500 की थी तो 150 रुपए ही बढ़ी है चाय की आई डोंट नो Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was asking uh, dream wala point uh, yeah. are, are you done we I, I I lost the track of that you No no there are a lot of things that you can interpolate here uh-huh. one is that uh, Sterling Cinema Hall mein wo film dekh raha hai a hmm. Sterling Cinema Hall mein Is it Sterling? Yeah yeah not the oh, Eros okay. that's that's what I uh-huh. read now yeah. so uh, Eros mein he Basuda f- saw the film for the first time the film that he saw was bicycle thief that made him come to this yeah, industry yeah, yeah, yeah. and by the way basuda wanted to be an actor when he yeah, came yeah, to yeah, yeah. to bombay as javed <laughs> akhtar sahab has, has <laughs> yeah. famously as mentioned anybody. in so many of his interviews and mm. even the one that he did with amazon uh, yeah. ivm ki unhone kaha tha ki ki uh, un, unko interviewer ne cyrus ne pucha tha ki uh, aap आपका कब कब आपने सोचा कि आपको राइटर बनना है तो इसे देखिए जब भी हम बचपन में फिल्म देखते हैं तो कोई ये नहीं सोचता मुझे डीओपी बनना है डायरेक्टर बनना है सब सोचते हैं मैं भी धर्मेंद्र बनूंगा मैं भी दिलीप कुमार बनूंगा तो एवरी ऑल ऑफ अस वांटेड टू बिकम व्हिच इज सो ट्रू वी ऑल फेल्ट लाइक बिकमिंग एक्टर्स वी ऑल फेल्ट लाइक हमारे हम पर कैमरा होगा हम ही मेकअप लगाएंगे बट या नो आई ऑलवेज वांटेड टू बी अ बारटेंडर इन अ आरबाल की फिल्म में ऑफ कोर्स ऑफ कोर्स चलो कम से कम किसी एक का सपना तो पूरा हुआ यहां पे एक का हुआ 
yeah. Sorry, you were saying. So he he actually did. Uh, he like, he has a cameo in the film also. Uh, he has a cameo in yeah, the yeah, yeah. film. छोटी सी बात में वो हमारे व्यूअर्स पे छोड़ देते हैं वो ढूंढ के पोस्ट करें एंड टैग देम ऑन सोशल मीडिया विद दैट स्क्रीनशॉट ऑफ द सीन वेर एवर यू फाइंड बासुदा इन दिस फिल्म एंड अदर फिल्म इज कॉल्ड द एल्फ्रेड हिचकॉक फॉर अ रीजन ओके एल्फ्रेड हिचकॉक ऑफ इंडी सिनेमा दैट ही इज इन सुभाष गाय तो बेकार ही बदनाम है बाय द वे सुभाष गाय आल्सो इज अ एफआईआई फेलो या या स्टडीड फ्रॉम फिल्म इंस्टीट्यूट एज अ एक्टर Yeah, and Not then he established his own film school, which <laughs> whistling yeah. boat. I'm just gonna put it out there. Very yeah, good yeah, yeah. school. <laughs> Please invite. I have friends studying there, so I had, uh, who studied uh, like passed out from there. So yeah, I would not like to say anything. <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> in that same scene, uh, the yeah. dream sequence that he he sees a film, he also has Vidya Sinha. कि अगर तुम फ्री हो तो पहले चाय पियेंगे उसके बाद इरास में हम फिल्म देखेंगे वो भी सीन ड्रीम में हो रहा है तो द सिटी ऑफ ड्रीम फॉर बासुदा वॉज ही बिकॉज ही यूज टू ट्रेवल फ्रॉम बोरीवली टू साउथ बॉम्बे फॉर हिज वर्क एंड ही वॉज अ कार्टूनिस्ट एज फ्री प्रेस जर्नल एंड बाई द वे द बॉम्बे एंड मुंबई कनेक्शन दैट आई ऑलवेज टॉक अबाउट इज वेरी फैसिनेटिंग टू नो इन नाइनटीन सिक्सटी वन बाला साहेब ठाकरे लेफ्ट फ्री प्रेस जर्नल टू जॉइन द मूवमेंट Hmm. of the marathi people and yeah. became a mass leader there was a vacancy for the cartoonist it was basu chatterjee who filled up that position <laughs> as a cartoonist oh, for free press journal oh my god yeah. and uh, you know, this is i'm i'm not as uh, surprised because he you mentioned this fact in your <laughs> in walk. The walk so yeah <laughs> Oh so more details come for the walk. Yeah, I actually, I was about to say that all the things that you're mentioning yeah. in your walk, you actually take people to those places. Mm. Uh, anything you want to add, Urjita? I have one more point that I want to talk about, and then we can do the categories. No, nothing. Uh, so, I wanted to like mostly conclude this by saying that what happened to the middle of the road cinema? Like, I was trying to think of a modern. comparison to a basu chatterjee or rishikesh mukherjee i know we mentioned uh, raju hirani but it's not exactly that right mm. where have all the characters like the the everyday middle class characters gone and do you ever see a resurgence of this kind of cinema happening again see uh, there is a historical process behind yeah. this it's called the economic liberalization that happened in 1990s right. under pv narsimha rao government yeah. manmohan singh was the finance minister yeah. at that time yeah. सो उससे पहले का सिनेमा जो था इट वॉज वेरी डोमेस्टिक वी हैड एन इनवर्ड लुकिंग इकोनॉमी आफ्टर नाइन्टीज वॉट हैपन वॉज फॉरन वॉज वेरी एक्सेसिबल टू अस यशराज साहब जो थे हमारे चोपड़ा जी एक और चोपड़ा वी आर चोपड़ा ब्रदर या सो चोपड़ा साहब चोपड़ा साहब ने कहा अभी वील शो द इंडियंस द वर्ल्ड आउटसाइड विच इज नॉट इन देयर hands correct wo kabhi ja nahi sakte mm. most of us would no never go to switzerland maybe mm. so he shot he shot switzerland aur wahan pe raj daud raha hai simran daud rahi hai tamam cheeze aur train chhoot rahi hai to switzerland mein bhi chhoot rahi hai fir hindustan mein bhi chhoot jati hai jahan pe fir simran jati hai matlab itna dekhna insaan matlab india se europe chala gaya fir bhi train pakad raha hai kam se kam us mamle mein to hum aage hai na unse to fir bhi dil hindustani wala scene hai na ki कुछ भी हो हमारे हाँ, देश में हिंदुस्तान है, है, है थोड़े अनाड़ी है थोड़े किला हाँ, हाँ, रुक रुक के चलती है अपनी गाड़ी ज, जो भी हो जाए वो लड़की का फायदा नहीं उठाता है रात में हाँ, अकेले हाँ, हाँ, चाहे कितना थोड़ा थोड़ा मोरलिटी हाँ, हाँ, बची थोड़ी सी ब्रा खींचेगा थोड़ी सी ब्रा के साथ खेलेगा बस बस वहाँ उससे ज्यादा नहीं है लेकिन अभी वो मोरलिटी बिल्कुल खत्म हो गई है आप सिनेमा अगर आज का देखे इट इज वेरी डिफरेंट सिनेमा फ्रॉम नाइनटीन से that like if if i as an audience see a person on screen who is jo bus mein travel karta hai train mein travel do you think that we have grown so out of it well like isme aspiration ka hai ye to main hi hu so i will not connect with it like wh- wh- how does that i think now the audience is trying to connect with a larger actor like ranveer kapoor in animal and yeah, others yeah. where they are क्योंकि इधर भी थोड़ा सा अंदर गुस्सा है इंसान के नाइनटीन mm. सेवेंटीज का जो एंग्री यंग मैन है mm. वो इसीलिए आया क्योंकि इकोनॉमिक प्रॉब्लम्स थी mm. देश में yeah. बहुत सारे पॉलिटिकल प्रॉब्लम्स थे इंदिरा गांधी के ज़माने में mm. एक बहुत समय उस समय का नारा था इंदिरा हटाओ गरीब इंदिरा लाओ गरीब ही हटाओ दैट प्रॉमिस फेल्ड सो दे वॉज लॉट ऑफ एंकर इट वॉज समथिंग अनहॉट ऑफ इट इज स्टिल अनहॉट ऑफ still it another, happened yeah. only once in yeah. history yeah now everything gets delivered all the, all time, the time every second yeah. before hand yeah before <laughs> <laughs> before the yeah. before the promise is made yeah. before, before, before the before the before the construction also <laughs> yeah 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 a lot of constructions yeah okay so, okay so, moving so, on from pani fir se i like it took you a second pani pi leta 
पर हाँ सो सो नो नो रिसर्जेंस इन साइड नो नो सो एक uh, एक बड़े ही अच्छे फिल्म मेकर हैं मनी कॉल उनका नाम था नॉट मैनी पीपल ऑफ माई जनरेशन नोज हिम बट उनकी बड़ी अच्छी फिल्में hmm. आप देखें कभी उसमें ए, उन्होंने एक चीज़ बोली थी कि जो हमने किया वो था न्यू वेव hmm. लेकिन जो श्री राम राघवन या अनुराग कश्यप वगैरह कर रहे हैं दैट्स कॉल्ड न्यू स्ट्रीम सो नाउ द रिसर्जेंस इज ऑफ द न्यू स्ट्रीम Okay. which happened in 2008 with dev d mm. and other films it stopped also very quickly yeah yeah kyunki institutional support nahi hai mm. nfdc and others like rashri suresh jindal produce some of these Correct, films correct mm. yeah abhi they have no market mm. an individual producer like suresh jindal who made chashme baddur and this and shatranj ke khiladi he, he produced <laughs> satyajit <laughs> ray's yeah, film yeah. suresh jindal passed away two years back i think last year and there's no individual producer now there is dharma there is yashraj there are production houses big production houses mm. and disney and others are also mm. came in mm. after 90s yeah. so the risk is a lot more a risk is yeah, uh, yeah. because mm. a lot more people's job depends on your decisions mm. now you make 600 crore film mm. which might not even do 10 crore of business mm. so utna zyada risk factor hai इसीलिए मुझे लगता है बहुत ही मासी फिल्म का ज़माना आ गया है जो अब न्यू वेव भी अगर आप देखेंगे दैट माइट हैव बिग नेम्स लाइक रणबीर कपूर और समथिंग नॉट पंकज त्रिपाठी एंड अदर दो यू हैव पंकज त्रिपाठी फिल्म कमिंग अप विच आई थिंक हैज डिफरेंट मोटिव्स देन देन एनीथिंग व्हिच वी कैन डिस्कस इन द नेक्स्ट एपिसोड श्योर यस Uh, but uh, i think like the closest we can get to uh, you know uh, getting back that resurgence of uh, uh, middle class i think maybe movies like bareilly ki barfi where even though like the movie set in a small town but it could have easily been shot in mumbai also if you look at yeah. the beats of the story it yeah, could have actors, been a mumbai film also this new crop of actors yeah. no uh, rajkumar rao yeah. and the uh, faruqi and others who The Manoj Bajpayee and the other fa- the, the Faruqi. Uh, no, not Faruqi. Yeah. Nawazuddin Siddiqui. Nawazuddin Siddiqui. Ah, why? I I got scared. I was like, he's not an actor. Faruqi is uh, not an actor. Meri chai reh gayi sorry. <laughs> chai ke bhi tar dimag band ho chuka hai. Uh-huh. But uh, Nawazuddin Siddiqui, Pankaj Tripathi, these are faces that people recognize them with. क्योंकि अभी हम शाहरुख जैसे तो दिखते नहीं सही बात तो ये है क्या लेकिन हम शायद सत्या के सौरभ शुक्ला जैसे दिख जाए क्या बात कर रहे हैं मैं थोड़ी शाहरुख जैसे तो दिखती हूँ तो हम वैसे कैरेक्टर्स के साथ अपने को जोड़ना शुरू करते हैं बट दीज आर वेरी स्मॉल बजटेड फिल्म एंड इनका रीच उतना ज़्यादा नहीं था ओ की वजह से आई थिंक दे गॉट अ प्लेटफॉर्म and i watched it on a ott platform bareilly ki barfi and all i never saw it on Correct, the screen yeah, hmm. yeah, yeah. same thing with uh, three of us the new film that yeah. came out yeah. such a brilliant film such new wave kind of film hmm. watched by स्मॉल फ्रैक्शन ऑफ पीपल और अभी वो नेटफ्लिक्स पर है लेकिन फिर भी उसका कोई इतना बोलबाला नहीं है mm-hmm. और काफ़ी सारी फालतू फिल्मों का बोलबाला mm-hmm. इस देश में है उसके ऊपर भी काफ़ी आपके इधर उधर के ओपिनियंस मैंने पढ़े हैं अच्छा ओके मैंने पढ़े अभी देखी वील डिस्कस दैट ऑन सम अदर डे बट इन इंडिया टुडे आई सी सिनेमा इन इन सिनेमा वी आर सेलिब्रेटिंग मीडियोक्रेसी instead okay. of perfection or anything of cinema mm. value mm. all the mediocre film get the awards like mm. i won't name them <laughs> come on i have to interview a lot of filmmakers <laughs> <laughs> so and actors but uh, mediocre films critics. are winning awards mm. yeah, mm. Okay. yeah national awards oh. sometimes <laughs> so and the national award uh, jury is headed by one of the best filmmakers ketan mehta yeah who made mirch masala mm. one of my favorite films ever so and yet. and <laughs> and then yet <laughs> okay cool uh, i think we should go to the categories we've been talking for a while so um ishan yeah. uh, again i'm going to ask you to put your historian hat on not that you ever took it off but <laughs> from ek aur ek aur pehle tha from choti si baat 1976 what do you think has aged the best and what do you think has aged the worst what what has aged the best is the depiction of bombay okay मेकअप से थोड़ा मुझे अल्टीरियर मोटिव वाला आंसर लग रहा है पैसा इन्वॉल्व है <laughs> नहीं बट मेकअप सेट में जैसे कौन करना कहती है कि बम्बई में सब कुछ बदल जाता है दरिया नहीं बदलता okay. इस फिल्म में एक भी जगह दरिया नहीं है दर इज नो अरेबियन सीन द फिल्म तो मुझे लगता है बॉम्बे का डिपिक्शन जो है वो वो मल्टीप्लिसिटी ऑफ कल्चर्स चाहे ऑन द फेस ऑफ बॉम्बे यू कैंट सी दैट बट विद इन द सोसाइटी ऑफ मुंबई यू सी द डिफरेंट कल्चर्स को एग्जिस्टिंग विद ईच अदर वॉट हैज वॉट हैजेंट एज वेल 
is the idea of stalking and other problematic stuff that we talked about the misogyny yeah but uh, i think uh, yeah, over, overall, overall score we will we'll, we'll come to yeah. that uh, urjita for you what is the best what is the worst so i think what has aged the worst is obviously the misogyny <laughs> yeah. but a close second would be the idea of mumbai because uh, hmm? uh, like the idea of bombay you know bombay is portrayed as this uh, 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 you know as the city that just welcomes you and it has so many things to do and you know it's not like come on let's let's yeah. be honest bombay doesn't, doesn't look like that you? huh you think it doesn't welcome no, you no as in it welcomes it doesn't welcome actually, everyone sadly <laughs> bombay died in th- that's actually a good point <laughs> if we're talking about back. aging yeah so it yeah. doesn't welcome everyone and also like it's not uh, when you look at the bombay in that film you feel like this is such a nice place and you come here and you realize ki nahi gadda hai har jagah construction aapke point ka inhone bilkul wo opposite wo mere walk mein abhi aaye nahi hai so uh, uh, what has aged the best yeah. i feel um, i think uh, just that just the character of amol palekar i Ooh. think i uh, even after watching kya baat kar rahi ho <laughs> yeah even after I, i feel like you know you have to accept a character with their imperfections also yeah, so yeah. considering given the time frame in which this movie was written mm-hmm. i feel like amol palekar definitely is one of the most progressive a- a characters yeah. he, the character arun. that he played arun arun, yeah. arun Pradeep, one yeah. of the most progressive characters of that time mm-hmm. so i think this character has aged the best okay. according to um me. dialogue sorry dialogues also have aged the best dialogues are yeah. really good uh, for me what's aged the best i think the Bombay yes and also the simplicity like i said i just don't see that simplicity of characters and yeah. story anymore uh, especially the first half what has an age the uh, age well is uh, you become cool when you become an asshole <laughs> like wo <laughs> jo t- table tennis wala scene hai wo jo yeah. wait karwata hai asra ni ko ke main bas yeah. chill karunga tu wait karega that is yeah. not cool guys don't yeah. be an asshole yeah. to be cool yeah. um uh, ishan if you have to program a double feature with choti si baat which film would you program i would choose chashme baddur who interesting mm. because that talks mm. about my my first uh, work city jo kehte hain mm. karm kshetra कर्म क्षेत्र वा क्या क्या हिंदी संस्कृत लाया हूं मैं बॉम्बे योर सेल्फ ओनली टैप पैट योर सेल्फ ऑन द बैक दूसरों को समझ भी आना चाहिए पहले उसके बाद उसका सामने से रिएक्शन आता है लेकिन चश्मे बद्दूर क्योंकि वो दिल्ली की बात करते हैं क्योंकि दिल्ली इज आल्सो वेरी क्लोज टू मी एंड देन बॉम्बे दिस सिटी छोटी सी बात सो दीस टू नाइस फॉर मी आई डोंट नो वाई बट इन माई हेड इंटरेस्टिंग यू मैंशन चश्मे बद्दूर मेरे दिमाग में ये ऐसे अनऑफिशियल ट्रिलेजी है छोटी सी बात चश्मे बद्दूर एंड जाने भी दो यार स्पिरिचुअली थीमेटिकली दीज थ्री फिल्म आर कनेक्टेड टूगेदर सो आई वुड एक्चुअली प्रोग्राम ऑल थ्री फॉर यूर जिता है अगर आज के जमाने में ऐसा कुछ होना तो कैसे होता प्रॉब्लम देर वोट बी अर्नल बट देर वोट बी बंच ऑफ फ्रेंड्स गाइडिंग दिस गाय so uh, no, you would have prem 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 yeah yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah from yeah. partner you you in, in that movie of prem and prem <laughs> <laughs> okay finally ishan on a hazard age well rating scale of 1 to 10 try and keep your personal uh, feelings aside if you had to rate uh, actually don't keep them yeah. aside keep them yeah. with you if you had to rate choti si baat on a scale of 1 to 10 how much would you rate um okay this would uh, challenge my own academic <laughs> intellect uh-huh. but Seven and a half. Okay. Yeah, out of ten. Okay. And is it a rewatchable film? Would you rewatch of it? Of course, again? of course. <laughs> it's a rewatchable film. It's a rewalkable walk. <laughs> so <laughs> nice. Uh, for me, uh, I mean. for the f- the first half is i think near near perfect i love it but the second half is very problematic so i would also give it a i would give it an 8 on 10 i think the second half despite being problematic if you compare it with some problematic films fr- of today of course, yeah, <laughs> it's yeah. it's very very but you know ki jo the film that is trying to be progressive to us pe zyada nuks nikalte ho it's ha. always that with people also jo jo already pro jisne bol rakha hai ki bhai main problem problematic hu wo agar ek insaan ki jaan bacha de ek andhe ko road cross kara de usko bolega are kya acha insaan hai but <laughs> the guy who is saying ki i am very progressive usme tum 100 nuks nikaloge so it's that uh, yeah. i think and rewatchability i think i would give it a 9 i think it's very rewatchable everything is 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 like very rewatchable uh, is it for you has it aged well i feel 8 okay uh, and rewatchability 
So, pretty high, <laughs> high scoring uh, uh, pretty film. High. Seven and a half, eight and eight. So, I think that's a uh, Choti Si Baat from 1976. Let's quickly do the alternate ending segment and uh, we'll tell you a little more details of uh, what Ishan has in store for us in the future. So, let's do the alternate ending segment right now. Okay, this is the alternate ending segment, Ishan, where uh, we suggest ऐसी एंडिंग जो ओरिजिनल एंडिंग से अलग हो लेट्स लेट्स से से बासु चैटर्जी कम्स इन योर ड्रीम एंड ही लाइक ईशान यू आर द चोजन वन आई वांट यू टू थिंक ऑफ अ न्यू एंडिंग टू छोटी सी बात और इफ यू वांट टू राइट अ सीक्वल टू छोटी सी बात व्हाट वुड यू व्हाट वुड यू डू So I'll I'll give you both okay. one sequel and one Amazing. alternate ending. Yes. The alternate ending would be that Ashok Kumar Sahab को अकल आ जाती है कि finally एक को तो प्रभा मिली हाँ क्योंकि उनको भी प्रभा नहीं मिल रही थी हाँ he closes his business and goes to Khandala lives peacefully कि मतलब और माचो मैन मन बना कि अब नहीं एक काफी हमने एक monster दे दिया है वो Frankenstein monster let him do whatever he wants to do. I am done. Okay. And he shuts his business and goes away. That's the ending that I would love to see. Okay. Sequel that I would love to see is what happens to Asrani after that. Mm. Yeah. क्या उसको लड़की मिलती है? Yeah. बिचारा उसका स्कूटर Actually yeah. वो मैं जानना चाहूँगा. It's it like the film pretty much serves up a sequel. Yeah. 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 Uh, that's good. Do you have an alternate ending in mind, Urjita? So, um, alternate ending. I feel uh, again. I feel like that message should have been clearer. That why did suddenly why did he become macho man? And even if he did, I think thoda sa hat tip dena chahiye tha. Maybe towards not a hat tip, but like maybe thoda sa inclination dena tha towards the fact that actually he's not macho anymore. He's not actually macho. Okay. He was just pretending, and she knew about it all mm. along. Mm. So, uh, like maybe how I joked about you know him actually eating varan bath with his hands. Maybe. you know like maybe like a post credit scene where he's trying to use chopsticks she pulls the chopsticks from his hand he's like kya hai se kya hai bas kariye mere samne nahi and then suddenly he goes back to being his shy self in that one moment i feel waisa agar kuch ho jata to maza aa jata nice uh my alternate ending <coughs> is the film ends as it does okay theek hai yeah then we fl- uh, then we cut back to bombay okay it's jahangir art gallery yeah okay we're following first person camera angle चलते जा रहे चलते जा रहे वी एंटर समोवर ओके वी ओपन द किचन डोर ऑफ समोवर ओके एंड वी सी अ मैन बड़े से कड़चे में कुछ बना रहे हैं ये तुम क्या बना रहे हो ये जो मैं चिकन आला पूज कह के लोगों को बता रहा हूँ ये चिकन आला पूज नहीं है इट्स एक्चुअली द मीट ऑफ अ डक आई डोंट नो वाई आई डिट आई नीड टू डू समिंग विद चिकन आला पूज <laughs> no, I don't want to make it dark. Okay, our producer is saying why not human beings. <laughs> so I was like, I want. I I was going in many dis- disgusting places, and I was like, no, let me just make it dark. अच्छा, so, so there was there were more disgusting ideas. Yeah, <laughs> like so for you, okay, that my, is my, my thing. You have to change the <laughs> ending because Basuda was a producer's director. He right. loved his producers, <laughs> and he always worked according to the producer. Now your producer has said something. You have to. चेंज सो आई वुड देन से दैट चिकन आला पूज में जो सीक्रेट इन्ग्रीडियंट आ रहा था वो एक्चुअली नागेश की कंपनी से था एंड इट वॉज एक्चुअली अ सीक्रेट डील बिटवीन दैम कि जो भी आएगा उसको चिकन आला पूज सर्व किया जाएगा ताकि उसका फ़ायदा हो सो समोवर एंड नागेश वर एक्चुअली इन कहूट्स विथ ईच अदर दिस वेरी बैड ऑल्टरनेट एंडिंग आई वुड लाइक टू थैंक ईशान भाई फैशन मूवी में अल्टरनेट एंडिंग एंडिंग क्या है कि कंगना रनौत एक्चुअली केक खा के मर गई थी <laughs> कंगना रनौत एक्चुअली वो वो फैशन उसके आइकॉनिक वॉक में दुपट्टा पहन के जा रही थी दैट इज व्हाट ही व्हाट इज आइकॉनिक फॉर अब्बास ओके बिफोर वी रैप अप वन सेकंड आई वुड लाइक टू शो दैट ईशान गॉट दिस रियली नाइस पोस्ट कार्ड्स फॉर अस व्हिच ही गिव्स टू एवरीवन हु टेक्स हिज वॉक व्हिच आर डन बाय कारवान हेरिटेज वेरी क्विकली टेल अस अबाउट व्हाट कारवान इज ईशान एंड व्हेन व्हेन कैन पीपल एंड हाउ कैन पीपल sign up for your heritage works carwan is a students led uh, history platform where we are trying to project history from a different angle okay hum bhi history ko thoda academy se hata ke aam janta tak pahuncha rahe hain wah 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 like basuda we are also <laughs> trying to reach to the public through a very accessible format of our walks and talks mm-hmm. on, through social media mm-hmm. instagram wagaira pe mm-hmm. hum kuch na kuch post karte rehte hain idhar udhar ki cheeze mm-hmm. बाकी आप व्हाट्सएप पे भी हमारे साथ जुड़ सकते हैं जिसमें ये वॉक्स के बारे में हम बताते हैं बड़े सारे वॉक्स होते हैं तो अगर आपको हिस्ट्री को जानना है 
mm-hmm. and this is across uh, cities across cities yeah, seven yeah. cities now mm. so we do walks talks and और गप्पे भी मारते हैं हम ऐसे ही हाँ। काफी अच्छे अच्छे लोगों के साथ तो वो बैठक उसे हम कहते हैं nice. तो आप कार्बन बैठक में भी आ सकते हैं सब कुछ मुफ्त होता है वॉक के अलावा वे कैन पीपल फॉलो कारवान पीपल कैन फॉलो अस ऑन इंस्टाग्राम एंड यूट्यूब कारवान हेरिटेज के आर डब्ल्यू डब्ल्यू एन एच ई आर आई टी जी ई देखिए स्लो वो लोकल मैंने बोला था ना रुक रुक के विल विल पुट द लिंक इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन आल्सो सो या या एंड वी कैन पीपल फाइंड दिस कॉन्वर्सेशन दैट यू हैव दे आर अवेलेबल ऑन आर यूट्यूब चैनल एंड पीपल कैन आल्सो फॉलो मी इफ यू दे वांट थोड़ा बहुत उधर भी हम जो अपना भी बता लेते हैं इंस्टाग्राम हैंडल मेरे मुझे याद होता तो मैं बता देता आई यू सीरियस आई यू जेन सी रियली योर 23 इट्स आई एम ईशान शर्मा अंडरस्कोर ओके सो बहुत मुश्किल है नहीं नहीं और ईशान की स्पेलिंग ऐसी है ऐसी भगवान ने भगवान तोबा ऐसा गलती ना कराए कल मुझे किसी ने एहसान बोला उससे पहले इमरान बोला मैंने कहा साहब देखिए डेमोक्रेसी में मेरा विश्वास है पर मैं ईशान हूँ ई एस एच एन बड़ा आसान शब्द है नाइस कूल Uh, all right, and Urjita, where can people follow you? You guys can subscribe to my YouTube channel at the rate Urjita Vani and Instagram account also by the same uh, username. But uh, yeah, love you. Thank you. Come for my shows. Nice, and you can follow me on uh, Twitter or X or whatever it's called now at Abbas Momin and Abbas Momin eighty eight on uh, Instagram. Uh, I've taken the walk that uh, Ishan conducts, and it's really worth your while. So check it out. And thank you so much, Ishan. Please come back. We'd love to uh, talk about films with you. हाँ अगर आप थोड़ा सा रोकड़ा सामने चलो थैंक यू विल फाइंड यू नेक्स्ट वीक ऑन दिस सेम चैनल एंड सेम प्लेस सब्सक्राइब टू द चैनल आई वी एम पॉप एंड शेयर दिस वीडियो विथ हुआ यू थिंक विल एंजॉय दिस इफ यू लिसनिंग टू अस ऑन ऑडियो प्लेटफॉर्म रेट एंड रिव्यू अस इट हेल्प्स अस रीच मोर पीपल हाउ मच आर यू लुकिंग एट वॉट मनी जस्ट एक करोड़ Thank you guys that was uh, that, on that uh, I I I am so glad my duck duck joke is not the <laughs> the worst joke to end on <laughs> we'll see you next week with a new guest and a new movie till then bye bye I V M